All right, so I'm gonna show you the option for laying down. So I'm not gonna go through how the core works. You can check out the other video uh, titled Piston Breath for that, which again is from Julie Weeb, physical therapist, look her up. I put a link in the description. Um, she has amazing content and I've learned all of this from her. So I'm gonna show you the laying down one. So you wanna have a few pillows on hand because you'll need to prop yourself. So in standing, we talked about the rib cage position. So when you lay down on the ground, it doesn't automatically put you in a neutral or stacked position. And the reason that we wanna have you in that position is because it allows you better access to those muscles, okay? It doesn't mean it's where you have to be all the time, but right now we're learning how to connect. And so we wanna put ourselves in the position that allows us to do that the easiest and the most efficient. So I already know for myself that I need a pillow. But if you lay down and your ribs are flaring up, you want to have a pillow. If they're, if they're really rolled down, you may just want to put a pillow under your head, okay? So I'm going to put a pillow here. And I can feel that my ribs are flat, nice and relaxed on the ground, and my head feels nice and supported. Now, I like to do this with my legs bent like this. You're going to want to do a slight pelvic tilt. So that's tucking your tailbone. So if you had a tail and you're gonna roll your hip bones up and then roll them back down. So it's a anterior pelvic tilt and a posterior pelvic tilt. Here's rocking them up and down. You will find that middle spot, okay? Some of us tend to be very tucked under and sometimes we're a little more like this, but I would argue that that comes more often from the rib cage. So if you've supported yourself here where your ribs are flat, it's unlikely that you're too far like this, but not, it's not never, okay? So I wanna find that middle position because that's gonna allow me to connect my pelvic floor more easily. Um, and it shouldn't, it shouldn't require a lot of effort to hold it here, okay? And things should feel relaxed and supported. And then what you're going to do is you're going to do your umbrella breath in 360 degrees. So into the lower ribs. And then breathing out and feeling them collapse. So for me, I don't move as well on this side, so I know I have to focus a little bit more on that. Okay, so, and then you're now going to connect the pelvic floor. So you're going to do your umbrella breath, inhale 360 degrees and feel the tummy let go, not pushing out and then feel the pelvic floor lengthen and open. And then you're going to start your exhale and feel the pelvic floor connect and lift. Okay. So again, this is to show you the positioning laying down. If in standing, you weren't able to feel the breath or feel the pelvic floor. So watch that video and this is how you can prop yourself in lying. And now, once you've worked on the piston breath and you can feel the pelvic floor lengthen and lift in, with your breath, you can add movement here, okay? So you can add moving a leg, you can add a knee fallout, you can practice getting up like that. So the same thing would happen. You would use your breath, you would move on your exhale. So I might do my arms and I might go breathing in, the, uh, umbrella breath, lengthening pelvic floor, starting my exhale, lifting pelvic floor, and then moving my arm and bringing it back up, okay? This is a, a, a simple exercise. It doesn't require a lot of effort from the body, but it's okay to practice those because you're learning a new brain strategy and it will make those harder exercises. It'll make you more efficient when you're doing them because you're gonna be using your body more efficiently. So again, you may only need a couple. It really depends where you're at in your recovery and what, um, what your um, pain problem is or your injury that you're dealing with but everyone can start bringing awareness to their breath and learning what their body is doing and putting this breath with movement. All right.